have sound, so I want to redo this so that you guys can understand how to save um, under 10 megabytes. So I would think that if you're saving in Photoshop, you guys would have a lot of layers here. I only have one. Let me just duplicate a couple just so that you can see what I mean. So I just made a couple layers here. First thing I'm going to do is check my image size. So I'm going to go up to image, image size, and take a look at resolution. Um, right now it's set to 300, which is print. I want to bring it down to 72 for web. We're going to be uploading to um, a digital version of this to, to the Cabrini College website. So um, bringing it down to 72 um, should be fine. If they need a printed version, we'll just save a copy at 300 dpi so that you have one just in case. Okay, so we hit OK. Should resize our image. Still looks fairly OK. So then let's um, go over to File, Save As. And we're saving it as a PDF. So your format. PDF. Um, we're going to save a copy. This automatically selects when you have layers, so you want to save a copy that's going to merge all those layers there. So let's get rid of copy and make sure one of ours changed to DCTS. This is how your file name should be named. Last name, first name, DCTS, grade, PDF. All right, so then let's save a copy. Um, go to compression. Right now, I would set it to maximum since we lowered the we lowered the uh, resolution, so uh, it shouldn't be on over 10 megabytes. So we'll save that. Select our file on the desktop and go over to File, Get Info. And you can see it's 3.5 megabytes now. And that's about it for this one.